Ahoy! Ahoy! Hey guys, it's Brittany, and welcome back to Brittany Ween 2019. Brittany Ween's Scoops Ahoy! Yes, Ahoy! Okay. <laughs> Y'all, I have no idea what I am supposed to be. Okay, I kind of have an idea. I'm supposed to be a doll that burns your eyes, that wants to burn your eyes out, so mm, I tried to burn my eyes out. <laughs> it's kind of like an inspiration of my girl, my queen, Bloody Mary. <laughs> you guys know me and Bloody Mary, we go way back. That is my queen right there. <laughs> Speaking of Bloody Mary, I actually have, I bought a Bloody Mary shirt from Spencer's like last month and I have to wear it in a video, but you probably won't see that shirt until November because obviously in Brittany Wayne we wear costumes. But I don't know, this look, I'm wearing my Wednesday Addams dress. I got like my Harley Quinn inspired wig. I guess I could have put it in pigtails. I don't know. And then I have like kind of like Bloody Mary inspired makeup. Um, but yeah, I just thought I was just gonna be my own little doll because this is this doll that I'm about to tell you guys about. Woo, girl. You guys know me and haunted dolls. I mean, clearly. Haunted dolls are like my life. Annabelle is number one. Robert is number two. Amelia is number three. Who's number four? I guess Harold? <laughs> But today's video is about a haunted doll from the UK and they say this is like the most haunted object in the UK. It's a haunted doll by the name of Grace. They think a witch from the 1600s is the one that took over this doll that is possessing this doll and this doll said on camera that they want to burn someone's eyes out so I was like holy crap I need this doll in my life. I want to meet this doll. What the heck is life? This is amazing. I'm gonna run towards this doll if I ever see her. So I guess I'm kind of like Grace, even though I don't really look like her. I'm just I'm just a weird doll today. A doll that wants to burn your eyes out. A doll that is evil as hell. So I don't know. I put like red in my waterline. I am not a professional makeup artist. <laughs> Clearly so, just work with me y'all. So guys, I have watched a few videos involving Grace, like she, she's in a box, right? Like all these haunted dolls are in a case and there's footage of her knocking on the box, like you actually hear the sounds, it's very loud. She has the ability to move and she speaks and she's very evil, she's very dangerous. Now I have watched these videos, they are online. I unfortunately am not going to put them in my video because of copyright. I don't own these videos. I don't want to get in trouble. I know people are like, it's okay if you put like a 15 second clip in. No, YouTube is so freaking strict these days, guys. You know, I don't understand how these like top five channels, top 10 channels, I mean like you guys do you. You guys are great, but I don't understand how they can use all these people's like footage and they don't get in trouble. Because if I did that, woo! I'd be hearing from YouTube within an hour giving me a copyright strike. You can see these videos online, you can hear Grace talking, it's pretty amazing and I'm very excited for this paranormal team that, you know, made these videos with Grace and captured these amazing spirit box responses and I just think it's amazing. So when I see fellow investigators gathering epic evidence, people who actually have a passion for the paranormal, people who actually live for the paranormal, who love the paranormal, like I am right there clapping away and just I'm so proud of you boo. So there's a lot of unanswered questions with this doll. They do believe that a witch from the 1600s attached itself to this doll during a paranormal investigation. They have Grace in a box, like a glass box, and they just are very unsure about what power she has. Like it's you know what I mean? And I think that's with anything in the paranormal. You never know. The paranormal doesn't just like work on cue. You never know what's gonna happen, you know? Whenever you are going to a haunted location, I feel like a broken record. Whenever you are doing an investigation, you don't know what's coming through. You have no idea. But I am willing to take that risk. Just like I know so many other investigators, that's why we're in the paranormal, because we are willing, willing to take that risk to see if anything will come through. That's why we're paranormal investigators, because we want to see shit happen. I'm losing my mind today. Oh my god, I'm starting to feel like I am Grace the Haunted Doll. Like, woo, I don't think she's going to be like this, but can you imagine I was a doll? <laughs> So the paranormal investigator who caught this amazing footage of Grace is Danny Moss and he is with the paranormal team The Haunted Hunts. So this video was captured when they were doing a public paranormal investigation. They asked 
if they want, if Grace wants to be released, and she said, burn. And then the investigator said, what do you want to burn? What do you want to burn? And then Grace said, your eyes. Just like that. Your eyes. So, and it's as clear as a bell. And my jaw dropped when I heard that. I was very impressed. I'm living. I'm so happy for this paranormal team. You guys are watching. Woo! Amazing. I'm so proud of you. <laughs> um, but, you know, that is scary. A doll saying, I want to burn your eyes. You know what I mean? So, ugh. I don't know, I'm just like living right now. I wanna meet this doll so badly. And what I think is absolutely amazing is when they captured Grace saying that she wants to burn Danny Moss's eyes out, they were on a public investigation. So the people of the public got to witness that. So can you imagine being a huge skeptic and coming on this like ghost tour, this public paranormal investigation, and this haunted doll is saying that? Also too, Danny was holding a crucifix in front of Grace, and that's when she's like, burn. And he said, what do you want to burn? Your eyes. Like, it, <laughs> I'm sorry, like, I'm always trying to, you know, every time, like, I say it in my head, it sounds, you know, whatever, like, cool, serious, and then when it comes out, it just sounds like, Brittany, why are you saying it like that? But that's what she sounded like. She was like, your eyes. And it's as clear as a bell, and I'm just like, ah. What's really interesting about the evidence they've gathered with Grace is whenever she's around, the knocks that they capture on camera, it's always three knocks with her. So I find that very interesting, the number three, three knocks. And also too, the voice that they always capture is the same voice, it's never different. So that right there, like I got chills and goosebumps just thinking about it, that's epic. Like I'm so happy. <laughs> for Danny Moss. I know he's probably like, what the heck if he watches this? But that is just, that's very cool. Like, I, I love when people gather such amazing evidence and they have gathered so much evidence with her, so many responses with her. And a few years prior to the whole burning your eyes, apparently this doll did say something about doing something to someone's eyes. And it was another public investigation and people's eyes felt like they were burning. But nobody thought anything of it because she never said burning your eyes back then until, you know, years later, she says she wants to burn your eyes. So they say that Grace is like the most haunted object in the UK, and they also compare her to Annabelle. So guys, my question for you is, who do you think is more dangerous, more evil, Annabelle or Grace? Since they are comparing her to the real Annabelle doll, to be honest, I think Annabelle, and if I could choose, to, well, I mean, obviously, I can't believe I met Annabelle, like, girl, what the heck is life? That was just a dream. I would absolutely love to investigate Grace. I would love to be alone with Grace. I would love to do a spirit box session with her. I would love to have my paranormal music box with her, you know what I mean? But who do you think is more dangerous? I don't know, I think Annabelle is. There's just so many freaking haunted dolls on this planet, and I wanna meet them all. Like, it's just, ugh, I just live for haunted dolls. So, <laughs> let me know what you guys think about Grace, and check out the videos, because they are just so amazing. And I don't know, when I see them, I smile. I know it's so weird because she's saying to like burn someone's eyes. I'm not smiling at that, it's just, like I said, when I see other paranormal investigators getting evidence, people who are passionate and just love it, and they get that evidence, it makes me so happy and proud. Even though we don't know each other, even though I know Danny Moss, but he doesn't know me. <laughs> but Danny, if you're watching, woo, I am proud of you. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you guys like my costume. I mean, it's just a mixture of everything. I think it's kind of cool, it's different, you know, I wanna be unique. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. Hashtag Team Brittany 44. Hashtag Book with the Fans. Hey, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.